And again, the hazard damage is going to be so, so nice. Especially because they went Basket Legion first. Ooh. Freest uh, Sacred Sword of my life. Let's go for it. Yep, free of Sacred Sword of my life. Today we're featuring Isui and Samurai. Ceaseless Edge is insane, right? Does a lot of damage because of your sharpness ability and gets up spike in an attack. I think this Mon has an, a ton of potential. A ton of potential. In this game though, probably not the greatest because it's a bunch of Pokemon that actually beat it. Uh, luckily though, they're really weak to Dragapult as a lead. It's extremely good versus their team. And uh, I'm pretty weak to Ursaluna though, so I'm gonna U-turn here as they end up going Magirna. Uh, they have no Earthquake switches on their team, so I'm going to go for Earthquake here. If this is leftovers or not, it's probably specs, but I still want Earthquake damage. As long as it's not Scarf, I'm good, but we still want Earthquake damage because, like I said, they have absolutely no Earthquake switches on their team. Um, leftovers. I'm going to make the Golden Go play. I'm assuming they're going to go for Will-O-Wisp. Yep. Nice. And then we can go for a Make It Rain. They don't know if I'm Scarf or not. Get a lot of damage off on Hoopa here. And I'm assuming a Hyperspace Fury is going to come out. So I'll make the Samurai play. Dark Pulse even better because I am Assault Vest right now. And we get a nice free Ceaseless Edge off to knock out Hoopa and also get up a spike. Uh, assuming that Cinderace wants to come in and try and court change it. I'm already doing my job, right? If y'all do enjoy this video, by the way, I kind of just started it off. But if you, if you do enjoy this video, make sure you let me know by subscribing, leaving a like. We're on our way to 400k. And I think Team's going to be on my website if I didn't already say that. So we'll pull it here. Pull it right now. Um... I'll go for Willow here because I'm not sure if they'll go Ursaluna or Magirna. But the fact that uh, they went out into, or, sh or they stayed in where Shifu was amazing, right? This is a giant threat. This is a huge, huge threat. And I feel like they're just going to give it to me, right? I feel like they're just going to give it to me because of the way they played it. So uh, their way of winning this game is for sure Magirna, though. However, we, again, see no item on this thing. So I'm going to Willow Wisp it. Okay, that's fine. Even if they Terra here, I'm okay with that. Basically, I get a free Earthquake. Because I am uh, Defensive Landers, but I am faster, and all that damage means I do knock them out. So, we're looking very good right now. Uh, doesn't matter if they go for Willow or not. I don't think these two can beat me in the end. As long as Pult's gone, I can just click Close Combat with Scarf Sneasler. I also have Sucker Punch in the end. They can Core Change and do whatever you want. That doesn't even do anything if they Core Change. Like, it would literally have to be... Uh, oh, what's it called? It, it would have to be like a bulk up Cinderace to do anything right now. So... Oh, look at Lando being the GOAT, living two, and Earthquake would be the only thing that could beat me. Alright, we go you first. Kind of see what your Terra type is. If they don't Terrastalize, that means that they lose this. If they Terra normal, that means they super lose. Let's give it Guts. No? I think is fine to sack. Or Shifu cannot beat me. Unless it was like a Belly Drum set, I guess, but... Let's go ahead and see how much this uh, this Samurott Sacred Sword does from right here. I'm assuming it kills. Yeah, that's oh damn near killed. All right, that sharpness boosted. It was the Belly Drum set though. It was the Belly Drum set. It actually could have been crazy there. It actually could have been crazy there had I not clicked. I should just click CC. But I've seen some that run like Terra Ghost, uh, which is why I didn't want that to happen. And I thought that maybe the end game could be bad. I guess in that case I could Shadow Ball it and I could Draining Kiss it and I could Cecil's Edge or Sucker Punch rather if I didn't want to risk Cecil's Edge. So that's probably a misplay on my part switching out. But whatever, we take the win to start it off. I'll pause until we find another game, guys. We'll be right back. So I played this person while testing. Sick team. They basically led Zapdos, and I beat them 1v1 with Samurott, which I think was really cool. Um, this is Terra Water Overcoat, which is, I think, the best way to use it, in my opinion. Um, I want to try and win the game with Magirna. I'll start Dragapult. Very, very strong versus their team. They don't like switching in on it. And this king can only hit me with Hurricane. So I'm going to go for Wisp first and then Hex it. Uh, just because that opens up my... Yeah, exactly, this is great. They didn't even risk Hurricane, which is great. Um, just because that opens up my... Uh, my Sneasler a bit if this thing's gone. Uh, so we'll drop a Draco on them. This will do about 70, 75%-ish. Assuming they stay in. They can go Iron Treasure if they really want to. Yeah, 73, 75. Almost uh, Rocks range. But, I mean, we got a really, really good start, right? We got a really good start. Um... Basket Legion is going to come out and probably click Shadow Ball. This is the female one. So we do have a Samurott that can come in on this pretty safely. And uh, just go for a Razor Shell, which is boosted by... Actually, let's see this Edge. I want to spike up. That's why you use this mod. Even though Razor Shell was a little bit better. Or, excuse me, uh, yeah, Razor Shell might have been better there. They can Thunder me if they want to. I want to keep this guy alive for this guy. It's really strong versus them. 
I don't see Golden Go doing anything for me, so I'd rather go Golden Go there. They do Hurricane. I can threaten them with a Scarf Shadow Ball. I'm not Scarf, obviously, but I could, in theory, have threatened them with a Scarf Shadow Ball. That couldn't even get a, a, a pair on me because I had Cover Cloak. So we get a Giant Threat gone, and um, I'm looking good. I'm just going to make it rain in front of this thing if they want a Terra. That's fine. They can crunch and knock me out. Whatever they want to do. If the lander's at full, I'm not going to lose to, to Overcoil. So if they SD, I know they're set because, again, I played them while I was testing out the team on a different ult. And this is the mod I really, really, really want to use, by the way. I really, really want to use Overcoat. I think it's such a sick Pokemon. I think it's such a sick Pokemon. All right. We could bring you out now. Can I get my rocks? That way Pelipper has, like, one switch in. Uh, ideally, I'm able to get up rocks here. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. I am not able to get up rocks there. I really want rocks up to limit Pelipper switches, and I don't think I need my Terra in this game to win, so... I'm gonna do this to get on my rocks. Uh, kind of worked out because they're definitely gonna give me this pill, uh, this kill on Pelipper next. Like for sure you're gonna give me this kill on Pelipper next. I know you are. Give it to me. Give me this kill. Give me this free kill. I, I just again, I wanted to limit the Pelipper switching so they don't have any rain to beat me down. Don't care about you coming out. I go route to Pult. If they spin, they spin. If they don't, they don't come with knockoff. Yeah, perfect. So we get a Will-O-Wisp off as well. And we've basically shut down Giant Threats. And this isn't the other Gudra. Also, I have Sacred Sword to always deal with Gudra. So I should be in a good spot. Um, and again, the Hazard Damage is going to be so, so nice. Especially because they went Basket Legion first. Ooh! Freest uh, Sacred Sword of my life? Let's go for it. Yep, Freest Sacred Sword of my life. I, I thought maybe... Um, not that much. I thought... Maybe they would try and go Treads, or maybe they would try and uh, bring out anything else, but it doesn't matter if Treads come down now. I just click Secret Sword again. They can't kill me with Earthquake. And I'm faster too, because there's support! Oh, I should have Razor Shelled then, damn. But they went for the wrong move versus me. We'll just go for a nice and Sacred Sword again. Beautiful. We're looking kind of good right now. Not trying to miss, just going to keep going for Sacred Sword, because Samurai's going on a mini sweep right now. Uh, this thing is most definitely choice locked, and I can knock it out with Sucker Punch always. So, Gudra comes out. Let's go, Landers. Useless. Oh, no, no, no. Not the Schmix. I got five. What am I saying? <laughs> I can't read. Oh, wait. I'm also a water type. I didn't realize they went. Yo, yo, yo. I didn't realize they went for Earthquake and got damage off of me, guys, because. <laughs> I didn't realize they got damage off on me. That's really funny. I'm Scarf, which is why I'm faster. Because I, because they only did 5%, so I thought, I was like, yeah, I'm immune to Earthquake. Yo. <laughs> Dude. Oh, my God. All right, that was a great game. That was a great Hisuian Samurai game, though. The the pressure of Spike and the Iron Treads being defensive. That's, I'm going to remember that, too, if I fight them again. I can just Razor Shell them next time. Ooh, Mono Dragon. Giant threats. Huge threats. Holy crap. Uh, very Magirna weak, but I mean, they have... I'm assuming Gujar just takes it on, right? Uh, let's see if we can get up Hazards. They might actually just end up doing the exact same thing, just getting a very Hazard. F Regieleki. Facts. Miss it, though. Right? I gotta, I gotta let them know, right? You got, Come on, you gotta miss it. F Regieleki, but you know, we want it back, you know? Yeah, okay, cool, cool, cool. Yes, that's the page we gotta be on. We, we hate you, but damn, we miss you, you know? Oh, Dragon Tail, please land. Perfect. Give me something good. Not terrible. I mean, this money ain't that great here, but it does give me a free spiker. I will gladly take this little spike up. I don't even think they have an attack to hit me, so I'll get my kill. All right, so we got a spike. I can I get an ice for better. All right, we got a nice little trade there. Trade for trade. Um, we're going to make the, the Sneasler play as they go. Gudra. And we're going to switch out because hopefully we have Poison Touch. Come on, Poison Touch. No. But this should be a free Dragapult just to click will o -Wisp. Unless this is Terra Fire, but if it is, then Lanners beats it, so. Terra Normal. Terra Normal, nice miss. You want to hit this next one? Because they can't Terrasilize, so I can win the game on Magirna. Good job, good job, you. Alright. Shake your time. Time to uh, do exactly what Gujar does in this meta game. I mean, you see me what Magirna does. I keep thinking Gujar's gonna come out on me, so that's why I'm doing this. But should be faster than everything. Let's go ahead and get another little boost. Boost. 
I guess this could Dragon Tail me technically, right? I just want to click this for recovery. Jeez, I get so much. There's a Dragon Tail. Alright, so free Earthquakes. They can't tear with anything. You're probably faster than me. Shift gear up. Combined up. I get a, I get a boost anyway because they're going to die. So might as well get my little combine, get my other boost. <laughs> nice soul heart. Oh, speed boosting. That's unfortunate. That's very unfortunate. However, same thing. I think I'm going to sneeze or win, but I could be wrong. Okay, yeah, never mind. Them going hardback Scalibur makes me feel like I'll Sneasler win. It does. It makes me feel like I'll Sneasler win. Dragapult comes out. They kill me, though. It's going to be close, but I think I Sneasler win. I have to get, I have to get this. Come on, Sneasler. Sleep, 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 sleep. No. Okay, Sneezer, sleep, 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 sleep. I can still CC things. Dude, I didn't even get poison. Wait a second. Did I just win? Did I just win? There's no way. There's no way I just won. I just won. But like, there's no way I just won this way. You were supposed to kill me and then... Try and win, but good game. All right, whatever. We take those. Eighteen fifty-seven. We'll take those, dude. I swear, dire claw when my opponent uses it is is is, is God, right? It's it's. I have no control. It's in charge. It's king. It's a dictator. When I use it, it's I don't know. It's for the streets, man. Because it's not for me. It's not working. It doesn't work when I use it. There is a 65% chance that some sort of status happens, right? Isn't that what it's supposed to do? Because it does a Dire Claw for each of them, and then it also does the Poison Touch checks and everything like that. And if I'm not mistaken, it's 65% chance that something happens that turn. And it's like it's like I'm using Jirachi's Iron Head and nothing's happening. Also, I'm a demon for saying sleep, sleep, sleep. But damn, has that happened to me a multiple times. Multiple times. But uh, yeah, we got another game. Ooh, I don't know if I played this person before, but they look very similar. This looks like Sash lead plus a bunch of threats. Actually, I think I did play them in the other one. Um, okay. Actually, I know what I do. I'll lead Sneasler into this because uh, Scarf Sneezer is going to be key, I think. Because I have to use it to switch to Magirna and then I have to try and beat them with Magirna. <laughs> Not what we wanted as a lead. Because they're just going to U-turn here and I don't really have a good switch in from that. Right, they Brave Bird it, which is alright. We got a Brox. If they want to Brave Bird again and weaken themselves, I'm okay with that. Because they can't default on me because I have a Golden Go, so. I'm assuming you're just U-turn as your last move. They're going to get out Samurai. They did weaken me, though, which is very important. Ooh, you coming in. If I get a Spadef drop, oof. However, we can safely go out to We should be able to go out to Samurai here. Live a hit because I'm a Salt Vest and also on the physical side I can tank it. And then just go for a Ceaseless Edge. Oh, there's Specs. That was super specs. Holy crap. Damn, dude. All right. Oh, hello here. I guess they just realized they don't need this mod no more. That's unfortunate. That Samrod died there. That's also, I'm pretty sure that's modest specs Hoopa as well. <laughs> that's the assault that's not working out. Um, but Hoopa being gone opens up Magirna a little bit easier. Like, not that Hoopa was a threat to it, but it could be. Right? In theory, it could be. They can also switch over with theirs though, so I gotta be careful. I'm so worried about Magirna. Like that mon is, I, I, I'm sure by the time Vitter goes up, that mon's being banned. Like I'm pretty positive that mon's being banned tomorrow. Draco is free, Willow is free, Hex is free. Okay. They have no reason not to Hex here. Yeah. Hex hella free. Do I wanna go that though? I could take my kill by Terrastalizing, but then that makes it harder versus Magirna. Okay, they, they Terra ghosted already. Damn. I'll take 40. I think we Draining Kiss to get health. They Terrastalize with Ditto right there. 
Well, that means they can't tear with Magirna, right? So, I, I mean, I got most of my health back, if not all of it. So, I just go Landers and play Earthway here. Yeah. I'm okay with that. I'm going to U-turn here just in case. I, I know I was taking Rocky Helmet, but I don't want them to ID fog on me. It's okay if they U-turn. Um, and that's the Samu that comes out. We'll go Sneasler on that attack. I think it's, it's going to come down to... Uh, I'm trying to think, because like I could CC there, I could of uh, CC. I just gotta get damage on this guy, because Samurai's gonna get as many spikes up as it wants versus me, and I can't stop that. This doesn't have to be max speed, but this mon's my way of winning this game. So, try. I'm just trying to think not to lose the Sneasler. Okay, they switched there, which is whatever. They think I'm fast as hell. Gonna recover once. Samurai probably being sacked here. I need to be healthy for these guys. I think this can beat Magirna 1v1, but I, I think I'm wrong too. Like, I'm not 100% sure, you know what I mean? I Magirna's the type of Pokemon that can beat everything. If it wants to. So... Perfect. Double down. They get up all three layers of spike, though. Can't stop that. I'm assuming Sneasler comes out. Which could be Trick Scarf. Uh, I'm still going Magirna regardless, though. I think I just try for this, you know? I really think I just try for this. Like, why not? Let's just, let's just see. I haven't been in this situation yet. Let's see what happens. Let's see if I can beat both Magirna... Because I am faster, which is very... I am actually faster, so I might be able to beat both Magirna and Ditto. Because Ditto obviously outspeeds me after, but... Hold up, hold up everything. I gotta stay faster than this guy. This is so dumb, by the way. Dude, Insta crits me! I'm faster, I have the one up on you. Are you kidding me, bro? Doesn't matter now. Insta crits though, come on. Like at least let me gauge damage first so I know for I'm not I'm not gonna be in that situation again, but at least let me gauge damage so I know what happens. Because if I'm faster, it means I have a higher chance of winning. I'm hitting first. But to get insta crit on a first attack is crazy. Samurai's pretty cool. Gets up all them hazards, obviously. His Samurai, you know, it's freaking sick, man. I like Sneasel a lot because Lander's is probably scarf on this team, and I'm gonna try and poison them with poison touch turn one. They are gonna get hazards up, and I can't really stop that because I don't have hazard control. Alright, it's Rocky Helmet. That's fine. I doubt the Earthquake. They definitely has the rocks up exactly. We found another slower than me. Oh. Yeah. Okay. You're minus one attack. I'll, I'll do... We'll do roughly the same damage, but I'm winning this because, yeah, you're minus one attack. Hmm. Get up as many hazards with Sneasler as I can. I'm mixing me with Samurai as I can, I think, is my play. I think that's my play to do this back to them. Dozo comes out and takes a punch. Yeah, I think I get as I think I get as many hazards as possible because they have no hazard control. So I just do this. Because if I force Dozo to rest as well, because I am Covert Cloak Golden Go, which is super strong here. I'm not tarot flying though. Draco doesn't kill, but it's still my best, best play. This thing has heal bell now, by the way. Pretty crazy. They finally gave Bussy heal bell back. I finally anything can do anything here. Uh, Stone Edge for the chip. If they smack down, that's fine. I don't want to switch in on Earthquake, so I'd rather do this. Nice chip. Yeah, exactly. I do not want to switch in on Earthquake. And now I'm going to make the crazy play. Oh, dude, Golden Go wins the game, but I'm doing it. Yeah, boy. Make my Maker Rain come out. Perfect. 36%. I'm going to Nasty Plot up once because they're not going to Earthquake. They might Whirlwind. They should Spike again. Uh, but basically, they can't kill me here, and I'll kill them. They might even rest. If they rest, oh, my God. This is going to be good damage. Because then these hazards being up are great. Yeah, 
exactly. Go on, give me this Ting Lu. They're like good and bad, right? Like, I have ways of winning, I have ways of losing. I have no idea how this end game goes. Like, this is. I, I don't have knock. Oh, and their boots on that too. Okay. Earthquake. Some of you. Okay, cool. So we can go Sneasler now. I think we. Oh, we can't even switch a room. Because they have Golden Go. If Golden Gold's boots as well, I think this is an L. Oh, okay. Um, 10%. If they let me burn this, and that's not Heal Bow on Blissey, I'm in a good spot to win. Yeah, I'll be in a good spot to win. Because if it's Thunder Wave, Seismic Toss, in theory, Golden Gold could beat it. But if I burn Clodzart, They know I can switch her, right? Let me you turn again. You know I can switch her. Just go golden go. Reveal your golden go set right now. There's a poison job. Pulse. Yes, okay, cool, cool, cool. That's exactly what we need. Perfect. Don't know if I lose to this or beat this 1v1, but we're gonna freaking try. There's heal bow. Oh, never mind. I definitely lose to this 1v1. Well, I shift gear up anyway, right? Because I need the speed to outspeed Landorus and potentially Golden Go. If I tear a water, I'll beat you as well. So you don't matter. Give me that. I'll get my next special attack raise. Why not? Terra Dark? Don't be Terra Dark. Don't be Terra Dark. Don't be Terra Dark. Terra Psychic, which is bad, just as bad. Hmm. Maybe that means Golden Go can win because they can't hit me for super effective. That could mean Golden Go wins by Terra. I'm gonna assume it means Golden Go wins by Terra. I mean, they should always go Golden Go, but I'm going to go for Switcheroo anyway, just in case they throw. Right, I, I need them to throw to win. Okay, it's Boots. I'll sack this. They can knock me out, and then I'll go Dragapult. I think... I think... I think Golden Go can win? Give me this, if, as long as they give me, if they give me their own golden goal, I might be able to win with mine. I'm not going to go hard in the golden goal. Okay. We tear and recover, and then we nasty plot up. Obviously they have unaware, but this guy's weak to it, and I don't know how much Don Doz is going to take. So, we'll see if it, golden goal, because I know at plus six I'm going to knock out Blissey, obviously, right? You don't knock me out. And I'm faster. Hell yeah. Okay. Okay. Chance ball? Chance ball. If they go Blissey next, then it's definitely because they can't Thunder Wave me even if they have it. I get plus six to knock out Bliss, and then everything else just gets regular Shadow Ball. Please don't. I don't remember if uh, Dozo took Spikes damage. I don't think it did. But I just got a spam. Okay. We're just going to Nasty Plot again just to make sure that if Blissey ever comes out, I'll kill it in one hit. I gotta be plus six to kill Bliss. This is basically like... I believe I beat this 1v1 even for rest because of uh, Spadef drops. I'm gonna Shadow Ball again on Dozo, very obvious, you know. We do a little outplaying right here. You, you can outplay all 20 billion of these? Oh my god, that did so much damage. That did so much damage. That did so much damage. Hold up. Nah, bro. Let me recover up real quick. You can't do crap to me. Good game. 
Goodbye, Blissey. You deserve a good rest. Okay. We found the win con versus that. We found the win con. And it did have to do with spikes up for, for nothing because they didn't really do much. But they helped versus Ting Lu. We did find the win con, though, in that situation. I knew one of my Terra Waters would do it. And I'm glad that my Golden Go ended up being faster than theirs. I'm assuming theirs was like around 244 speed, maybe 252 uh, speed area. And we were around the uh, fast as hell. <laughs> 264. Jeez. Look at this Golden Go. Let's go. I get my gold and go. Sick Freak Senior? Their team is insane, by the way. This guy, all these guys super sweep. Every mon on their team is a demon. Every damn mon on that team is a demon. Luckily, I have Scarf Sneasler. I'm very scared. I'm just going to U-turn. I'm very terrified of, of Terra Steel turn one just because of uh, uh, me. I would do that. Plus, I'm also faster. You get me? Poison, poison, poison? Poison? Ah, uh, unfort. Alright, so we get up spikes because my dude's hazard control is, is situation. It's a good hazard control. It is good in this game. I'll, I'll give him that. This is not going to kill, but I might as well get more layers and force a recovery. They should go for one more recovery, I think. Okay, so now they're going to go uh, Decidueye. They should have went Decidueye. Maybe a Fulcher Terra. I'm uh, hoping a Terra Fairy, not water. Water's harder to deal with. I could be Specs, so like, you shouldn't... You don't really have a switch in, to be honest, like looking at your team. I really wish I hit the last Siege Ledge, but... Because I want as many eyes as possible to deal with, with the the Drago, the backs. It could all be Boots, though, to be fair. But I feel like the Sidua is the U-Turner, uh, excuse me, is the Defogger. So, I think that's the case anyway. I'm hoping for a Terra here. Whether it be fa fairy would be great, like fairy would, because then I can just hit them with Sneasler's attack. Like fairy would be really, really, really good. They did not care. Right, we're gonna just try and weaken them a bit. Can you land your attacks? You want to land your attacks, dude? So I have a shot at this game. Holy crap, man! Whatever, I need this mon for everything, but I can't force now that they've done that. Terra Dragon! <laughs> Damn, that's sick though. Anyway, we drop a Draco to the... It's not gonna land, by the way. Them being Terra Dragon means I'm pretty positive they lose to Magirna. I'm just gonna will this. I, I feel like this is the physical play rough variant. Close enough. You gonna sneak me? Pretty sure you lose to Magirna now that you've already teared. Like, I'm almost positive. Perfect. Shift gear time and win time? I think so. I definitely shift gear first. That's for sure. I need to be faster than everything. Namorous comes out. Gonna Terra. That don't matter. I get too many boosts. I get too many boosts. I just need to get enough boosts to kill. I'm okay with that. I'm definitely okay with that. I mean, what are you gonna bring out? This thing Sash? Yeah, I'm about to say, like, what's about to come out? My, yeah, this month's stupid. <laughs> I'm fairly confident this month is going to be banned today, but um, alongside maybe Chien Pao and a few other months. But their team, like, the second they tear it with this, this is possible. I'm not saying that this wasn't possible anyway, but because they tear it and were forced to switch out versus Draco, like, if they have enough boost, they'll beat Magirna regardless of if I do it, because they'll, they'll, uh, they'll overwhelm me with um, like plus five Shadow Ball or whatever they ended up having at the end. But Samurai was solid in this game. I very much enjoyed uh, Samurai on this live. Cecil Ledge missed a little bit too much for my comfort, but uh, I really enjoyed Samurai. I actually enjoyed it so much that it was my first draft pick in my next Pokemon Draft League. Yeah, that's crazy, right? I was 14th to be fair, okay? So cut me some slack. But Samurai was my first draft pick in, uh, well, that's what they say anyway. It was my first draft pick in uh, the PPL Pokemon Draft League that I'll be uploading with real soon so 
yeah, anyway, hope y'all enjoyed. Team's gonna be on my website, Pokemon.com. I'll see y'all in the next one. Peace.